Hello everyone, this is Paul from Dintech. In this tutorial we're going to be doing the termination of a Category 6 UTP solid core cable onto a Dintech Cat6 UTP uh, shuttered style F-Jack. So what we're going to need for this is obviously our Cat6 UTP cable. We'll need our F-Jack. We're going to use the Dintech working base, the Dintech strippers, uh, we'll need some cutters for cutting off the stripping cloth and the central spacer inside the cable. And we're going to be using the um, 180 degree or F style easy tool. So first we will strip off about 40 millimeters of sheath. We just need to run the strippers round only once just enough to score the sheath we don't want to cut all the way through and into the wires below we can take the cutters and then take out the cloth then expose the central spacing part and we'll cut that out as well next we're going to take the working base and we're going to place the the shuttered F jack in star inside this uh, working base. You can see inside the back of the jack, it's got a series of colours, and these colours will actually tell you whether you're going to be terminating using the 568A or 568B termination specifications. Now today I'm going to do a uh, T568B termination. So I'm going to place my jack into the working base and I'm going to start with my green pair at the back and place the wires down on the jack. Then I'm going to take the orange pair and place that on this side of the jack. Then we'll take the blue pair, which is sitting over on this side. And finally, the brown pair. Now those are in place. You'll see by looking at this um, laying of the wires that I've got everything in place so that the twists come right up to the termination points. Now if we keep the twists right up to the termination points then we're going to minimize things like nearing cross torque. That's going to give our um, final installed link a much better bandwidth. Okay, So I'm going to remove that now from the working base. Take my Dintec Easy tool and place the jack in. It's got a couple of slots on the sides and they slot in sideways like this. And then just simply need to crimp the tool down. What that does is it terminates all the wires onto the IDCs at one time and cuts off any spare wire as well gives us a much better termination than using impact tools. Lastly we take the um, dust cap which has some spacing separators in there and the role of those is not just to keep dust out it sits down on top of the wires and stops movement of the wires on the IDC terminations. Now we can use this sort of jack uh, for applications like putting inside uh, wall mounted trunking uh, areas where trunking and you don't have a lot of room at the back so you don't have a lot of room to have cables coming out of the back so you can bring them in from the side or we can actually turn this and bring it out of the back as well if we want okay so that's a termination using category 6 a Dintec category 6 UTP cable terminating onto a Dintec cat 6 red shuttered 
if style check.